a few on this noonday hour. We could be anywhere doing anything on our lunch break, but we decide to get together as a body of believers. Hey, Sheila, God bless you. Thank you for tuning in to Thursday's Midday Breakthrough Hour. God bless you. We're going to uh, pray in a minute. Just want to share it out a little bit, if that's okay. Then we're going to do what we came here to do, and that is to pray. Amen. Hallelujah. Hey guys, let me know where you're viewing me from. If this is your first time on this broadcast, put a number one there. We thank you for joining us and for the return viewers. God bless you. Thank you for returning to Thursday's Midday Breakthrough Hour. Hey, Merle, God bless you. Thank you for tuning in. Let's share the broadcast. Let's share, share, share. Sharing is caring. And in the meantime, we're just going to exhort the name of the Lord because truly he is worthy to be praised from the rising of the sun to the going down of the same. He is worthy to be praised. Amen. Amen. Hey, Kenya, God bless you. Share the broadcast, please. Share it with your friends, your family, your frenemies, your enemies. Share it in a watch party. Share, share, share. We want as many people praying this noonday hour as possible. Amen and amen. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Come on, let's just exhort the name of the Lord for a minute. Hallelujah. For a few seconds. Glory be to God. Everything is better when we uh, exhort the name of the Lord, when we lift up his name. Hallelujah. When we begin to magnify the name of the Lord, the enemy have to flee. The enemy have to flee from us. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. God, you are worthy, Father God. You are worthy. You are worthy. You are worthy. You are worthy all over this place. Father, we thank you for another noonday hour. We thank you for another day, another moment. God, we just bless your name, oh God. We bless you, Father. We exhort you, God. We, we magnify your name. There is no name like the name of the Lord. Hallelujah. At the name of the Lord, every knee must must bow and every tongue must confess that Jesus Christ is Lord. Hallelujah. So we're just blessing his name. Hallelujah. While we still have the breath in our body, while the blood is still running in our veins, we just want to exhort the name of the Lord. I don't take it for granted. Hallelujah. I don't take this opportunity for granted at all. Hallelujah. For the Lord God is worthy. Worthy. Hallelujah. I know when I begin to exhort the name of the Lord, when I begin to bless the name of the Lord, when I begin to magnify his name, hallelujah, the atmosphere uh, shifts. Hallelujah. If I was feeling bad or anything was in the room that shouldn't be in the room, have to go out of the room. Amen. Because light and darkness cannot dwell in the same place. Hallelujah. The Bible say that everything that have breath ought to praise the Lord. Everything that has breath ought to praise the Lord. So hallelujah. We just praise you today, God. We just magnify your name, God. We just glorify you today. Oh God, you are the love of our life. You are the keeper of our soul. Jesus, we thank you because you are our kinsman redeemer. We thank you for your grace and your mercy today, Father, we honor you on this noonday hour. Father, we give you a yet praise. God, we give you a yet praise. No matter what, oh God, no matter what the struggle could have been this morning, no matter what the struggle may have been before we came together, Father. 
Father God, we just lift your name up, God. You are worthy, oh God. We exhort your name on high today. We exhort you all around the globe, no matter where the people are viewing from, oh God. We come collectively, Father, just to bless you today, Father. We exhort you. We exhort your name. Hallelujah, because you are worthy, oh God. Today, we will not allow no rocks to cry out for us today. We open up our big fat mouths and give you a praise, oh God. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Glory be to God. God, you are worthy, oh God. Make your presence known, Father. Make your presence known in this room. Make your presence known, oh God, all around the globe today. Make your presence known, oh God, no matter where your people may be viewing from today, God. Make your presence known, oh God. Show yourself mighty today, God. We honor you today. We bless you today. We lift you up on high today. Oh God, we glorify your name. We magnify you today, oh God. Oh God, we bless you with the fruit of our lips today. Oh God, we give you a yet praise. We give you a resounding praise. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Glory be to God. Well, Guys, thank you uh, for joining me once again in Thursday's Midday Breakthrough Hour. I don't know about you, but I can show stand a breakthrough. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. For God is worthy. He is worthy, 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 worthy to be praised. Hallelujah. I don't know about you. Hallelujah. But I, you know how sometimes we say we didn't wake up on the on the right side of the bed. Uh, uh, cliche saying. Hallelujah. Well, can I tell you today? I didn't I didn't wake up uh, happy to be here. If the truth be told, you know how the psalmist said, I was glad when they said unto me, let us go into the house of the Lord. But today I felt so so like, God, what is this? What is going on? God, I don't even feel like putting one foot in front of the other today. Can I tell the truth about it today? Hallelujah. Glory be to God. My daughter looked at me about an hour ago. She was like, Mom, are you, go are you doing your broadcast today? And I just like... Just shook my head. She said, you don't even feel like you went to it. Hallelujah. Can the truth be told today? Hallelujah. But I tell you this one thing. No matter in spite of what I felt like, glory be to God. God is still worthy of the praise. Glory be to God. No matter what mood I am in, because I can tell you this, God is not a witchy, washy God. He is the same today, yesterday, tomorrow, and forever. Come on, hallelujah. So he deserved to be praised no matter how this lady feel. He is still worthy to be praised. And can I tell you, your praises, hallelujah, confuses the enemy. Your praises confuses the enemy. Hallelujah. Can I tell you, when I begin to open up my big fat mouth, the atmosphere in here just changed. Come on, somebody. Hallelujah. You want the atmosphere to change? You want want uh, whatever going on in your head and in your, your heart to change. You want the situation to change. All you got to do is open up your mouth and begin to glorify him. Begin to magnify him. Hallelujah for he is worthy. Hallelujah. So we serve notice on Satan today. Hallelujah. You will not have our praise. You will not have our worship. You will not have our service to the Lord. Come on. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. God, you are worthy. So I want to just uh, share this Psalms with you uh, quickly. Hallelujah. It's a word that the Lord gave me uh, probably Monday or Tuesday as I was seeking the Lord in prayer. And I just heard the Lord uh, give me this word, two words, but one word to share here. It's unify, unify. Come on, hallelujah. God wants the people of God to unify. So I want to read this scripture, Psalms 133. If you have not shared the broadcast yet, go ahead and share it. Share it with your friends. Share it in your groups. Glory be to God. I get sometimes people.
people to share it back to me, but I don't need it shared back to me. I need you to share it out. <laughs> I need you to share it out. Amen. Hallelujah. So share, share, share. Glory be to God. It may be the it may be the prayer, hallelujah, that saved somebody. It may be the prayer that saved somebody. I want to read Psalms 133. Behold how good and how pleasant it is for brethren to dwell together in unity. Mm. It is like the precious ointment upon the head that ran down the beard, even Aaron's beard that went down to the skirts of his garment, as the dew of Hermon, and as the dew that descended upon the mountains of Zion. Hallelujah. For there the Lord commanded the blessing even life evermore. Amen. Hallelujah. The word of the Lord has already been blessed. May it be a blessing to every hearer and doer of God's holy word. Come on, somebody. Hallelujah. The word of the Lord is already blessed. Glory be to God. And the word of the Lord is unity, unity. That's why I read Psalms 133. Behold how good and pleasant it is for brethren, sisters and brothers to dwell together in unity. That's what the devil does not want us doing. The devil does not want us to uh, join together in unity. Come on. It is like precious ointment upon the head that ran down Aaron's beard when Aaron, the first high priest. Moses' brother was being consecrated for that office. Moses anointed his head with oil and it ran down all the way to his beard down to the very sacred garment he was wearing. Amen. The Bible say in unity that place of unity is where the Lord command his blessing. This is why the enemy may uh, try to put us at odds with one another. Put us at odds with one another even across cross race Racial and ethnic lines put us at odds against one another with husbands and wives. Come on, put uh, put I'm sorry, not put us together, but bring division and discord. Come on, hallelujah. Long racial lines bringing tension in the earth. Come on, bringing tension in the house, even with siblings, even with co workers on the job. Hallelujah. But the Bible wants us to have unity, unity. Hallelujah. There is where. Where the Lord commands his blessing. The Lord commands his blessing where there is unity. Hallelujah. Even as we come to this sacred time of prayer. Hallelujah. I hope that you are not just coming here just to be coming. And I'm not coming just to be coming. Because the Bible said where any two or three gather together in his name. There he is in the midst. Hallelujah. But if we are not gathered together. Hallelujah. In the name of the Lord. God is not there. We are just there. Hallelujah. Just to be there. Come on. Hallelujah. But the Bible said where any two or three gather in his name, then God is in the midst. Come on. He said where any two touch and agree on anything. Hallelujah. According to God's will, it shall be done. Come on. I come to touch and agree with you in prayer today. And I hope that you have come to touch and agree with me. Come on. We want to touch and agree with the word of God. Hallelujah. The word of God today is unity. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. I even hear the Lord say that he's going to begin to do a shake up in some of you's homes. Come on. Hallelujah. There's been some tension. Glory be to God. Some of you have been walking on tight, tight ropes. Come on. Hallelujah. One person saying one thing and the other saying another thing. But the Bible says that a house divided against its Self cannot stand. Come on. Even in business, come on. One business partner have this idea, this vision for the business, and another business, the other business partner have another vision for the uh, business. Glory be to God. But anything that has two heads is division. Come on. Hallelujah. But God don't want us working in division. Glory be to God. Because the vision could never be worked if we have two heads.
says there could only be one. Who is the Lord talking to today? Come on. God want us to get it right. Hallelujah. Or get left behind. Come on. Hallelujah. We have to come under the authority. Hallelujah. Of the word of God. Hallelujah. Even in the house, there should be one vision to the house. There could only be one leader in the house. Come on. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. There can't be many leaders in the house. Come on. Hey, la boshando robosha. I hear you, Holy Ghost. Hey, ya roboshande. Some of you are struggling even in your homes. Come on. How do you think that you can get it together at work? Hallelujah. Uh, at church, in the ministry, in your business, when your home is not together. Come on. God is speaking today. Hallelujah. God want his people to walk in unity. God want us to, hallelujah, unify. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. The Bible says, Glory be to God. When you have two working towards a cause, you will have a great reward. But it takes so much more effort and so much more work when a person has to work all alone. But when you have a partner, somebody that you can come into agreement with, somebody that you can come into alignment with, glory be to God. You're going to see your efforts, glory be to God, take off like that. God is looking for partners ships in this hour. Come on. Hallelujah. Even in some of these movements that are popping up. Come on. Hallelujah. There can't be 10,000 leaders. Hallelujah. It's got to be one chief and a whole bunch of Indians. And it doesn't mean anything. Hallelujah. Wrong with being an Indian because everybody has a part to play. Here's the thing. As long as you're playing your part, then we can see some. Hallelujah. We can see some, uh, we can see some reward. Hallelujah. We can see some victory for our effort. Glory be to God. But if we continue, hallelujah, to be divided, come on. Hallelujah. We will never get to the finish line. So God is looking for his people, glory be to God, to walk in unity. Glory be to God. And then sometimes we have to give up what we think. For the sake of the greater good. Come on. Hallelujah. There are some times when we have to. That's that's a hard pill to swallow. For some people. Hallelujah. To give up what you think. For the greater good. Come on. Hallelujah. This thing is bigger than you. This thing is bigger than me. Come on. Hallelujah. God want his people to unify. God want his people to come together. Glory be to God for the greater good. Hallelujah. That's in your house. That's in your community. That's in your business. Hallelujah. That's in some of your, your, some of your marriages. Hallelujah. We can never get to the finish line if we are so divided. Glory be to God. Who is the Lord talking to today? Glory be to God. You know, many people have lost big time, big time lost because they couldn't uh, put down their ego for the greater good. Sometimes we have to drop our ego for the greater good. We want to walk in, in unity. We want to walk in love. We want to walk in mutual respect. Uh, spec. It doesn't mean that we we lost. Come on. Hallelujah. It doesn't mean that you are a loser. Doesn't mean that I am a loser because I walk in a uh, oneness with those that God has called me to. Come on. Hallelujah. It doesn't mean that I've lost because I have mutual respect for uh, mankind, my, my, my fellow brothers or my fellow sisters. Come on, somebody. It doesn't mean that I lost because I have admiration or concern. Come on. Hallelujah. I look at the bigger picture and the bigger picture is unity. Come on. Hallelujah. The Bible says in Psalms 133, oh, behold how good and how pleasant it is for sisters and brothers to dwell together in unity. That's blood sisters and brothers. Yes. Come on. Hallelujah. Blood sisters and brothers and those that we are bound to because of the blood of Jesus. Come on. Hallelujah. Even our uh, spiritual sisters and brothers. God want us to, to walk in unity. Glory be to God so the mess can be cleaned up. Come on. Hallelujah. So I want to pray in that vein today. Hallelujah. Praying uh, for unity. Hallelujah. And if you have a prayer request, you can go ahead and put your prayer request there. And 
uh, I'm going to see it prayerfully. I will see your prayer requests. And, and we are here today in the spirit of unity. Glory be to God. And that is... Uh, the unity of the Lord, because we we, we, we didn't come here, hallelujah, uh, to, to unify with things that's not like God, but we came to unify with the word of God. Come on, hallelujah. We come to touch and agree. Glory be to God with our sisters and with our brothers. Can I tell you, I need you. You need me. We are a part, hallelujah, of one family. Come on. Hallelujah. The book of Acts. Glory be to God. He say out of one, out of one blood, he made one race. I hear some people say you are not of my race. There's one race. There's the human race, but we may have different, uh, we may come from different, uh, backgrounds, ethnical backgrounds, but we are of one race. Glory be to God. We have to stop seeing people through the eyes of love. Come on. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Sometimes we got to love people right out of their mess. I thank God for Jesus that he loved me, that God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son, that whosoever believe in him should not perish, but have everlasting life. God loved us so much till he sent his only son, his only son to die on the cross. Glory be to God to buy back our pardon. If it wasn't for that kind of love, I would have never met you and you would have never met me. So we thank God, hallelujah, for the word of the Lord today, which is unity. Come on. Hallelujah. That's right. Our pastor street to say we need each other and I definitely need you. Come on. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. When I'm down, you can pick me up. When you're down, I I can pick you up. Come on. Hallelujah. When you're hungry, if I got it, you can get it. Come on. If I'm hungry and you got it, I should be able to get it. Come on. Hallelujah. That's the type of unity that God is talking about. He's not talking about the, uh, we're looking at each other side eye. Come on. No, 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 no. God want us to roll in unity. Glory be to God that we care. Hallelujah. If you hurt, I hurt. Come on. Hallelujah. If you rejoice, I'm, I should be able to rejoice. We should be helpers one to another. Hallelujah. Help us one to another. And we are to raise our children. Those of you that are still raising children. Hallelujah. Raise them to be helpers one to another. Raise them to be their sister's keeper. To be their brother's keeper. We are in a day where we need unity. Hallelujah. Like never ever before. Come on. Hallelujah. We need to be unified. Hallelujah. Like never ever before. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Let us pray. Hallelujah. Dear Lord God. Hallelujah. I come to you in the name of Jesus. And I pray for unity among your people, Lord God. Father, we pray that you will bind our hearts with love for you, for one another, for community, for those who sometimes even ruffle our feathers in thoughts and deeds. Father, we pray that you would forgive us for trespassing against one another. Forgive us for trespassing against you, oh God. Give us the wherewithal all to respect those who are different from us that way that way we may live in the bonds of unity with one another father thank you for giving us the power to bind and lose and so father right now we bind the spirit of division and discord we bind strife and rebellion we bind envy and malice in the mighty name of Jesus and we loose the spirit of love and joy and and peace in the Holy Ghost among your people, O oh God. Hallelujah. In our neighborhoods, in our families, O oh God. With our siblings, O oh God. Father, we loose the joy and, and the peace and the, and the love of God, even in the body of Christ, Father. Even in the churches, even in our, our businesses, O oh God. Even in our workforce, Father God. We pray for the love of God, the peace of God, the joy 
joy of God. Hallelujah. In the mighty name of Jesus. Father, we thank you today, God. Father, we pray that you will build us up where we're weak, where we're worn, where we are torn, oh God. Father, we pray that you will build us up today, God. Father, we pray that you will just breathe upon us, oh God, with a fresh anointing, oh God. Hallelujah, Father. We thank you, Father, for this is a new day. This is the day that the Lord God has made. We shall rejoice and be glad in it today, God. No matter what come our way, Father, we pray today that we not become weary in well-doing, oh God. Father, because you say in due season, we shall reap if we faint not today, God. Father, we pray for all those that are tuned into the broadcast, God. You know them name by name, oh God. You know what they stand in need of, oh God. Father, we thank you today, God. We pray that you will show yourself mighty in their lives today, God. Show their, yourself mighty, oh God. Father, those that are uh, uh, having doubt in their heart and in their mind today, God. We rebuke the spirit of doubt. We rebuke the spirit of fear today in the name of Jesus, Lord God, and we loose the power of the Lord. Hallelujah. To come upon your people today, God. Father, we thank you, Father. God, we pray today, Lord God, that you would touch all those that are suffering with every manner of sickness and disease, oh God. Oh God, we pray, oh God, for those that that we are connected to today, God. We pray that you will heal their bodies, oh God, from the crown of their head to the soles of their feet today. Father, we pray for a visitation into the homes today, God. A visitation in the marriages today, God. Everything that the devil meant for harm in the lives of your people marriages today, Father. We rebuke it in the name of Jesus. We call it null and void. We deactivate the the chains and the cords, the feathers of the enemy over their marriages today, God. We rebuke it today, God, and we loose the love and the joy and the peace of God, the strength of God over these marriages today, oh Lord God. We pray for the single men and the single woman today, women today, oh God. Father, we pray that you will strengthen us today, God. We cast all our cares upon you, Lord God, for you care for us, oh God. God. Father, we pray that you will continue to meet our needs, continue to sustain us, oh God, continue to allow us to walk in holiness and righteousness before you, oh God. Father, you say that there is no temptation that is common unto man that you have not made a way of escape for. And so, Father, we bind the spirit of fornication. We bind the lust demon in the name of Jesus. We bind you every chapter challenge that will come up, hallelujah, in the single person life, we rebuke you, we call you null and void in the name of Jesus, Father, we thank you right now, we sanctify our bodies unto you, that we will be in unity with your word, oh God, Father, we pray today, God, for those single uh, men and single women, oh God, hallelujah, that is seeking you for godly mates, oh God, Father, we pray that you will hear the cry Oh God, hear the cry, oh God. Father, we pray that you will place them strategically, oh God. Hallelujah, that the husband will recognize the wife and the wife will recognize the husband. And in this season, Father, God, we pray that you are the matchmaker. You are the matchmaker even for the single. Hallelujah, men and women today, young, middle-aged, and old, oh God. Father, we thank you. We thank you for doing a new thing in the earth today, God. We thank you, Father. God, we just lift up the children before your throne of grace, Father. Hallelujah. We lift up the school board, oh God, all of those that are making decisions on behalf of your children, Father. God, we penetrate, hallelujah, those entities with the blood of Jesus. We penetrate those entities with wisdom, knowledge, and understanding right now, God. God. Give them wisdom and what to do in this season. Father, like David had met mighty men of God on his staff that knew what Israel ought to do in those seasons. Father, we pray, Father, that 
that you would raise up mighty men and women, oh God, and place us strategically in the industries, oh God, in which you have ordained for us, oh God. Father, we thank you and we praise you today, God. We bless you today. We bless what you're doing all around the world, the land, the sea, the air, even under the sea, God. We bless you today, God. We thank you for a mighty move of God. We thank you for a mighty move of God in this prayer. Hallelujah ministry today, God. We asking you to touch Oh God, each and every person one by one, oh God. Father, we pray that you would deal with us, oh God. Hallelujah. Coming to according to your loving kindness and tender mercy, oh God. Oh God, we asking you to do it today, Father. Oh God, we asking you to do what no other power can do. In the mighty name of Jesus, Lord, we thank you today. We praise you today. We glorify your name today, God. Oh, God, we thank you that you are mighty, oh, God. You are mighty in all your ways. Oh, God, we thank you today that you are the Alpha, the Omega, the beginning and the end today. Oh, God, you're fairer than 10,000. You are the great I am. Oh, God, you are our righteousness today. And we exhort your name. Jesus, we thank you. Hallelujah, that we can call upon your name. Jesus, we thank you that you ever live to make intercession for your people. And Lord, we thank you. Hallelujah for this noonday intercession. God, we cry out, holy, holy, holy. Holy is the Lamb of God. Holy, holy, holy. Holy which was, which are, and which evermore shall be. Lord, we cry out to you today, Father. We ask that you will heal our land, oh God. We ask that you will restore today, Father. Oh God, we thank you for a move of God in the earth realm today, God. God. We asking you for a mighty move of God. We asking you to loose your ministry and angels, oh God. Hallelujah, right now, Father. We asking you to loose your warring angels, oh God. Father, we thank you today, God. Oh God, we ask that you will open, hallelujah, our eyes today, God, that we may be able to see, Father, hallelujah, clearer than before, God. We ask that you will anoint our tongues today, Father, that our tongues will be like the pen of a ready writer. Oh God, we ask you to keep a watch over our mouth, Father, that we will not speak anything that you have not spoken, Father. Hallelujah. We bind up the spirit of gossiping. We bind up the spirit of confusion. Oh God, hey, we loose the good news of God, that we will use this tongue, oh God, to share the good news of God. Oh God, to lift your name up to exalt your name today, God. Oh, God, we thank you for a mighty move of God. We thank you, Father. God, we just thank you, Lord God, for every ministry. Hallelujah. That is touching and agreeing. God, we lift up abundant word life harvest church, oh God. Father, we ask you to move, hallelujah, in that ministry, oh God, for your honor and your glory, God. We ask you to touch Pastor Street, oh God. Give her a fresh anointing, God. Touch her body, oh God. Anoint her ear, oh God. Give her word from on high, God. Hallelujah, that as she stand before your people, God, hallelujah, the Holy Holy Spirit will quicken her, oh God, that she will minister the words of life, Father. Hallelujah, oh God. We ask you, oh God, hallelujah, that a ministry will stand out, Father. Hallelujah, that it will be like a light on top of the hill. Hallelujah, glory be to God. Like that it will be a lighthouse. Hallelujah, in the dark. Hallelujah, it will be a place, oh God, that people can go to, Father. Hallelujah, to get the honor of Saturated word of God. Hallelujah. That it will be a place where people to go to, oh God, that they will be healed, delivered, saved. Hallelujah. Set free. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus. Oh God, we thank you. Oh God, we thank you today, God. We praise you today, Father. We bless you today, God. Oh God, we ask you to touch powerhouse. Hallelujah, international ministries, oh God. God, we pray, oh God, that you will continue to move. Hallelujah, through this ministry, oh God. Father, we ask you to send the resources, oh God, that will make ministry easy, God. Send in the helpers, oh God. Send in the destiny workers, oh God. Oh God. 
Oh God, we ask you to move, oh God. We ask you to sanctify and to purify, God. This ministry, Father, anew, afresh, oh God. Oh God, take us into the deep, oh God. Hallelujah, Father. Oh God, we pray today, God, as we set down our nets into the deep, oh God, that we are coming up, oh God. Hallelujah, with a catch. Hallelujah, that we don't have room enough to receive, oh God, that we will be able to beckon unto other ministries, oh God, to say, come, get what God has given to us, oh God. Father, we thank you, we praise you, oh God, because we have more than enough, oh God. Father, we, bl we bless you today. Oh, we bless your name today. We bless your name today. We bless your name. We bless your name. We bless your name. Hallelujah. We praise you. Hallelujah. I even hear the Lord said, mm, that blind eyes are coming open today. Blind eyes are coming open. Hallelujah. That's in the natural and that's even in the spirit. Hallelujah. The Satan has tried to blind some of the, the eyes of God people. Hallelujah. So they can't see which way to walk in it. Hallelujah. So they will not be in unity. Hallelujah. With those that God has called them to be in unity with. Hallelujah. But I hear the Lord say, hallelujah, that he's opening up uh, blind eyes today. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Even, hallelujah, in the natural. Glory be to God. There's somebody today, hallelujah. I don't know if you're on this uh, broadcast and you're having trouble with your eyes. I don't know if you're here, hallelujah. I don't know if you're going to come to the replay. I don't even know if you are standing in the gap for somebody, hallelujah, that's uh, blind in their eyes, hallelujah, their eyes are going dim. All I know is I hear the Lord say that blind eyes are coming open. Hallelujah. So, and if you are standing in the gap or if you know someone, hallelujah, glory be to God that is going through that. Hallelujah. Why don't you just come on and give the Lord a praise for them? Glory be to God. God say blind eyes are coming open. Hallelujah. And Father, I thank you today. I thank you today, Father. You're not a man that you should lie. You're not the son of man that you should repent. Whatever you say, it will come to pass. Father, I thank you. Glory be to God because you have allowed me, hallelujah, to see your hand in miracles before, Father. And I thank you. You're the same today, hallelujah, yesterday and forever. You are a incredible God. You are a remarkable God. Father, we thank you because you are the great physician. Hallelujah. There's no God like you. There is no physician like you. Oh, God, you have made the human body. Oh God, you know how to put it back together. Even though Humpty Dumpty uh, sat on a wall and had a great fall, the king horses and the king men couldn't put him back together again. But Father, you have made us and we are wonderfully and fearfully made. Hallelujah. Anything that goes wrong in our body, you know how to put it back together. And so Father, we thank you. God, we thank you. We thank you for a touch from you today. We thank you for healing today, God. God. We thank you, Father. We thank you for healing. We thank you, God. We thank you, hallelujah, for moving, oh God. Hallelujah, in this noonday hour, God. We thank you, God. We thank you for healing. Hallelujah. Healing is your children's portion. Deliverance is your children's portion. Father, we thank you, oh God. Hallelujah. We thank you. We thank you for rescuing your people. We thank you for rescuing your people from the enemy, oh God. Even those that are bound up hallelujah and and sex trafficking oh god we thank you for setting the captives free oh god we thank you hallelujah for allowing those vi victims to be set free today oh god and father we decree and declare by the mighty name of jesus Glory be to God, even those that are holding the people bound. God, we thank you today. We ask that you will loose your warring angel and go and begin to deal. Hallelujah with all those that have your people 
captive and bound today. God, we thank you. We thank you, God. We thank you for what you're doing right now, Father. In this noonday hour, Father. God, we bind a candelabo shande lekota rikondorobo shande deko rikata. We bind. We we bind the works of the enemy today. We bind your powers in the mighty name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Ashley say yes in her sight, in her right arm, standing in the gap for her in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. We stand in the gap with you, Ashley. Hallelujah. As the Lord gave that word. Hallelujah. His word don't return unto him void. We stand in the gap for her. Hallelujah. That God is going to do a wonderful thing, a miraculous thing. Hallelujah. In her life. Father, we thank you today. Father, we thank you today that chains are being uh, loose today. Shackles are coming off of your people today in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Father, we thank you. We love you today. We bless you today. We exhort your name today, God. Hallelujah. Father, we thank you that you are more than enough. More than enough in the name of Jesus. Father, we thank you today. We thank you for pouring out the oil of unity today. Hallelujah. That we have unity even in our communities, even among our neighbors. Hallelujah. Father, we let all things go. Hallelujah. And we press towards the mark of the high calling. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. I even hear the Lord say, hallelujah, even for some. Glory be to God that's finding it hard hard, H-A-R-D, hallelujah, in their heart, H-E-A-R-T, to let those old things go, hallelujah, we pray for you today, glory be to God, we pray, that you will let it go, let it go, let it go, and move on, move on, forgive, 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 as God has forgiven you, Father, we thank you today, hallelujah, that the captives are being set free, Father, we thank you today. We are not bound by no old, old things that happened to us. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. No matter what people have said against us, no matter the lie that has been told against us, no matter how our feelings, hallelujah, has been hurt. God, today we start over. We start over. We let it go today. We let it go today. Oh God, we walk in unity. We walk in unity, unity with the word of God. Hallelujah. For Father, we know no. Hallelujah, that you fight our battles. You fight our battles in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Father, we thank you that we are more than conquerors. We are more than conquerors through Christ Jesus. We are more than conquerors. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus. Amen and amen and amen. Hallelujah. Glory be to God like I've said before. In times past, hallelujah, over these Thursdays, glory be to God, God is up to something good, hallelujah, in spite of what we see going on, and yes, there is a lot that is transpiring, glory be to God, hallelujah, but God is still in the midst of it all. Glory be to God. God is still in the midst of it all. Hallelujah. There are some things that God still want to get through to us in the midst of everything that is going on for those that have been faithful. Hallelujah to the call of God. Those that have been faithful in your walk of God. Hallelujah. I just want to encourage you today. Glory be to God to hold on. Hold on to God's unchanging hand. Hallelujah. Unchanging hand. Hallelujah. Continue to build your faith, your hope. Hallelujah. On things above. Glory be to God. God is a keeper. Glory be to God in the midst of everything that may be going on. What I want you to do today. Hallelujah. Is look around you. Hallelujah. And count your blessings. Name them one by one. And you can see what God has done. Amen. Hallelujah. We want to shame the enemy. The enemy always want us to look to cry. 
uh, poor mouth to say all oh, this, that, and the other. Glory be to God. But if we can name the things, hallelujah, that God is doing and God has done in our life, it will let you know. It will be a testimony unto you. Hallelujah. That God is still in the midst of his people. Glory be to God. God is still in the midst of his people. Hallelujah. Somebody inboxed me the other day. Glory be to God telling me uh, the testimony of the blessings of God, of the goodness of God, that God, hallelujah, in the midst of everything, hallelujah, how he is still coming through, hallelujah, for his people. So we have to think on things that are honest, think of things that are pure, things of lovely, things of a good report. Think on those things. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. I hear the Lord say you are a fighter. Hallelujah. He has ordained us to fight. Hallelujah. And we fight with the sword of the spirit. Hallelujah. That's the word of God. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. When we use the word of God, it does not return unto him void. Glory be to God. E kandorobo shandi di ku rabashate. Lebo si kondorobo shikande. Randi di ku rabashande. Lebo sha kandorobo sha. E kandorobo shi kandorobo sha. Hallelujah. I even just heard the Lord say, Hallelujah. God want to match your giving today. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Whatever God is telling you to do today. Hallelujah. Whatever God is uh, causing you to give today. Hallelujah. I want you to give like you're giving it unto the Lord. For the Lord God. God say he want to match your giving today. Hallelujah. God say he want to do exceedingly abundantly above all. Hallelujah. That you could ask or think. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. According to the power that, that work it within. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Even the enemy will cause you to feel like, you know, this is not the time. Hallelujah. That we should give unto the things of God. Come on. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. God say, give, give, give. Hallelujah. He say, he want to match your giving. Hallelujah. Exceedingly, abundantly. Hallelujah. I didn't come on here to say that. Hallelujah. I speak as the oracles of God. I speak. Hallelujah. As God has spoken to me. Amen. I came to talk about unity. Glory be to God and pray for unity. Hallelujah. But I, I quickly, I heard the Lord just say that. And I'm going to be obedient and, and say what God, hallelujah, has, has said to me. Glory be to God. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Somebody, hallelujah. Glory be to God. I hear the Lord say you need a quick fix. Hallelujah. Whatever it is you are, are facing. Glory be to God. You need, you need a quick fix. You need God to do it. To do it for you just like that. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Glory be to God. I'm, 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 you see me emptying out my Bible. I was looking for something. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Mm. We, we, we can't beat God. We can't beat God. Hallelujah. And I know I'm talking to some mature people right now that you already know that. We can't, we can't beat God. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. We can't be God no matter how we try. And I, I don't know where we get that saying from, how, how we try. Let me even stop that. I never even tried to beat God because I, I, I know I'm just a vapor unto God. Hallelujah. We can't buy him. Hallelujah. I'm saying that for the people that may not be mature. Hallelujah. And the things of God. Hallelujah. And some of us have been debunked by uh some things that we have heard and and then some things that people have did that wasn't like God and has uh, made us feel, made you feel some type of way. Hallelujah. Towards even your giving. Hallelujah. But I just I, 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 I just heard God. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. And it, it, I will be remiss if I don't say everything that God has told me to say. Say one part, but then fold up when it comes to saying about giving that that was something God had to really begin to deal with me on and and if you uh have been coming here for 
sometime you would you would see that that that's not even my focus hallelujah glory be to god sometimes god will tell me to say things like that and because of the people oh i'm not gonna say that but how many know that's obedient that's disobedient amen when you want to say one thing but not say everything amen hallelujah you see me um i i, I was looking for a check just to give a an example hallelujah just the the other day i don't do i'm not telling you to do something God didn't tell me to do or something that I don't even do. Amen. Hallelujah. As I gave the other day, glory be to God. Uh, my daughter walked in, walked in here. I'm sitting here last night and I'm, I'm studying the word. I'm going over the word and she came and hand me something and I look and it was a check. Wasn't nothing she owed me. I look at the memo or the check and say, a seed for ministry. And I was like, oh, wow. Well, God bless you. And I said a prayer for her. Asked God to bless her according to what the Holy Spirit uh, gave me to pray over her. I say all of that to say this. Hallelujah. Just as fast as I released, God released back to me. Amen. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. And those are, uh, I hear the Lord say there are even some doors. Um, I just heard the Lord say somebody need a quick fix. Understand you, you, you're not buying nothing because you, everything in the world belongs to God. The earth is the Lord, the foot is thereof and all they that dwells within. He is the king of glory. Everything in this world belong to the Lord. As much stuff as I have all around me, I couldn't get nothing without God. I'm, I'm, I'm just a steward over the things that he has given me. Amen. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. I was about to make a point. Hallelujah. Everything. Somebody need a quick fix. That's one thing I heard the Lord say. Somebody need a, a quick fix. You, can, you can't buy it. Amen. Only thing you're doing is releasing your faith. That's the only thing you're doing is releasing your faith. Come on, somebody. Hallelujah. To say, God, I believe the word of the Lord that you have given unto your servant. Amen. And I hear the Lord even say, hallelujah. Not only the quick fix, but God is getting ready to open double doors. Doors. Come on. Hallelujah. God is getting ready to open double doors. Glory be to God. And these double doors are going to, hallelujah, be served as a testament, as a testimony, hallelujah, of what God, hallelujah, can do and will do and is doing. Glory be to God in the life of his people, even in this season. I'm reminded of the word of the Lord that he gave me in March. Hallelujah. That this is the season. Hallelujah. To gather the spores. Hallelujah. To gather the spores of the enemy. Glory be to God. Come on. Hallelujah. The enemy is in a losing season. Can I tell you what the Holy Ghost is saying? The enemy is in a losing season. Glory be to God. But he will try to project it as the people of God being in a losing season. No, baby. Hallelujah. This is a winning season for the people of God. Catch that. Hallelujah. This is a winning season for the people of God. This is a losing season for the enemy. Come on. Hallelujah. This is a season hallelujah where the people of God, hallelujah, it is mandated for us to pick up the spoils. Come on. Pick up the spoils of the enemy. As much as the enemy is losing in this season, come on, this season was designed for you. Glory be to God. But the enemy, hallelujah, is trying to portray it to the people of God because we see what's going on in the natural. Glory be to God. But this is a season where we need to open up our eyes into the spirit. Open up our ears into the spirit. Open up our heart into the spirit. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory be to God, hallelujah, that you will be able to see and be in the know as to what God, hallelujah, want to do in his people and what he is doing in his people. I've seen a lot of people, Burt Ford, uh, 
businesses right in this pandemic season. Glory be to God. Because they were able to see the need, hallelujah, of certain things that was going on. They didn't sit back on the bandwagon and say, oh, what's going on? Glory be to God. Hallelujah. They, they, they were smart enough to say, I see this need. Glory be to God. And I have this gift and I have this talent and I'm tapping in. Glory be to God. I'm tapping in. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. They that know their God shall do mighty exploits. That's what Daniel said. Come on. Hallelujah. They that know their God shall do mighty exploits. Come on. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Glory be to God. Ti kandolo bo shande de ko rabasha. Ri kondoro bo shande. Hallelujah. I hear you, Holy Ghost. Glory be to God. And, and you know, sometime I thank you, Lord. I thank you for this word. Come on. I thank you for this word of unity and unify. Come on. Hallelujah. Even if it's not you, glory be to God, that God is telling you to do something in this hour. But you see a sister or a brother, glory be to God, that God is calling them, hallelujah, to do something in this season and in this hour. And you know them, glory be to God. The Bible say, know them that labor among you. You know them, you know their spirit. Come on, hallelujah. Some people say, uh, you know, God say, know no man after the flesh. Know no man after the flesh. But you know them in the spirit and you see what they're trying to do. Glory be to God. It ain't going to hurt you to move in unity. Come on. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. You know, I don't have much, but here's $50 to wash your vision. I don't have much, but it's here's $10. Come on. Hallelujah. And if you know that, uh, hallelujah, a kingdom assignment. Come on. If you know that's a kingdom assignment. I see a woman of God the other day. Hallelujah. Uh, making masks. Glory be to God. And she showed me some samples of it. Now I have many and I don't need, I don't need no masks. Glory be to God. But it wasn't going to hurt me to purchase a mask. Come on. I, I cash I, I app her and say, give it to a homeless woman. Come on. Hallelujah. Did that $10 hurt me? Do I need $10? Yes. Glory be to God. But I know that what I make happen for somebody else. Come on. God will make happen for me. Glory be to God. My $10 to help her business and to encourage her and then turn around and say, give it to another sister. So that was like a checker move. I'm helping you, but I'm also helping another sister, a homeless sister. Come on. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. When, when we can open up our eyes and work in unity, come on, then it will be like the oil that ran down from Aaron's head down to his beard, down to his robe. Come on, somebody. Hallelujah. I'm not talking things that I don't do. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. I, I, I'm trying to help somebody. I'm trying to help them double doors to open for you. I'm trying to help them double doors to open for you. The double doors that God showed me. Hallelujah. That's waiting for you. Come on. Hallelujah. Right now. Come on. Hallelujah. This is a right now word. Come on. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Oh, oh, come on. Hallelujah. I don't have enough to do. Hallelujah. What I want to do now. Hallelujah. But my $20 can help somebody else. My $5 can help somebody else. As long as you know that you are sowing into good ground. Hallelujah. God got you. And then there's a time that we feel like because we help this person, this person should help me. It don't go like that. God says we should be able to reap from grounds that we didn't sow in. Come on. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. I may have not sown into this ground, but God has caused that person to share their harvest with me because I've sown into another harvest. Come on. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. I'm trying to get them devil doors to open. Hallelujah. In the spirit. God say, if you believe my word, you shall be established. If you believe my prophet, you shall prosper. Come on, somebody. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. God want us to work in unity. Hallelujah. I'm, I'm on a call last night. Hallelujah. Invited to a call and I was so sleepy. I was so tired. Hallelujah. Did I really want to just be there? But I know that this other young lady is trying to do something. 
And so if I can set my alarm clock to stay up, to be on her call, to encourage her with the business she's trying to do. Come on. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Who need those double doors to happen, to open? Who need those double doors to open? We got to walk in unity. Hallelujah. When we know it's good ground. Hallelujah. When we know it's good ground. Come on. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. We got a, a testimony. Monique says, amen. I always reap from grounds that I've not sown into the kids to give. Come on. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Glory be to God. We should look for the return from, from an individual. Amen. But our reward, our reward and investment comes from God. Hallelujah, says Ashley. Amen. Hallelujah. So I'm going to stop right there. I know when to stop when the Holy Spirit stop. Amen. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. And with that being said, hallelujah, I have a prayer journal class coming up. Hallelujah, starting uh, July the 29th, it's a e-course, a e-course, amen, starting July the 29th, every Wednesday, hallelujah, it is a e-course, there are going to be videos that's going to encourage you in prayer, encourage you in the word, hallelujah, encourage you to pray the word, Hallelujah, because when we pray the word, God word, we know it does not return unto him void. It is like we're being uh, accountable, hallelujah, to, to just like to journal our prayers. And, and then sometimes some people say, I prayed and I prayed and didn't seem like God answered me. But God answered on his time, amen, and according to his will. And there I've been journaling for years. And sometimes when I go back and look, and then journaling is also therapeutic as well. Uh, sometimes you're just heavy laden and, and sometimes you don't know how to utter it out of your mouth, but you can write, uh, the Bible say, make your petition known and you can write your petition to God. Amen. And sometimes when I go back and look, I see the things that God has answered. I see the things that I'm still yet waiting to answer. Amen. And, and like I said, it's therapeutic. Sometimes when you just want to get it all out, you can journal. Amen. So we're going to be doing this journaling class and uh, the the journal comes with the with the class. Uh, there's four online videos to encourage you uh, talking about prayer, talking about the word that you can follow along with every Wednesday. And then on the fifth Wednesday, we will do uh, a Zoom for questions and answering on the fifth week i've shared the link and i'm going to share it again and if you know someone that will be interested in the class you can please help me to spread the word um in addition to the journal i'm going to be giving you three uh prophetic uh empowerment declarations that you can use uh, as you're driving, as you're working out, as you're walking, as you're cooking and cleaning to help um, motivate you. So you're going to get the journal. You're going to get three prophetic declarations that you can decree and declare over your life. All for the low cost of $65. After this, uh, I, I will be raising a price when I offer it again. But I'm offering it as $65 as the introductory price. And when the slots fill up, um, then I would have to cut, cut it off. So I put the link out there for you. If you can kindly share it for me, I appreciate it from the bottom of my heart. And if you want to be a part, uh, you can hit that link and make your payment through PayPal or Cash App that secures your spot in the prayer journaling class. So, God bless you guys. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you, Pastor Streeter, for joining me. Thank you, Monique. Thank you, Peter Proctor, my cousin in Alabama. 
That's the million dollar man right there. Hallelujah. That's my million dollar cousin. I'm coming to Alabama to get my share of that cuz. <laughs> I ain't going to let you keep all that money to yourself cuz. I got to come and get my share. Hallelujah. God bless you, Bishop McGee out of Atlanta. God bless your ministry, Bishop McGee. He and his wife have an awesome prayer ministry. Hallelujah. Now they are returning to the church. Hallelujah. God bless you, Ashley. God bless you, Sheila. Uh, and all the replay viewers. God bless you. God bless you. Thank you for tuning in. And if you haven't shared the broadcast yet, go ahead and share, share, share. God bless you.